Ray Dick and Wave because it's video. <laughs> Whoa! Enjoying themselves today. Here comes Tom. Here comes Tom, everyone. We've been waiting for you. Over you go. Well done. Well done, everybody. Half five. A warm welcome to my latest video, which is the Withal and Hollywood Fun Run that constituted of 5K, 10K, and the Families on Track Fun Run. And it was an absolutely amazing turnout. Which was a race reinstated after a number of years not being here, but brought back with some extra. You can wave to the camera. How are you doing? I'm guessing you'll be flying today. Not flying now. Can I keep up with you? Family fair. This is going to be Casey's first 5K. Ah, right. Wow. Excellent. So you look forward to it. So you're not going to be flying today? No. no. We're going to be running around and having some fun. Excellent. That's what I want to see. <laughs> it was great seeing so many familiar faces here with such a massive turnout from around the area and beyond. It was just brilliant. And as I was saying, the atmosphere was pretty buzzy. For me, I just went out ready to collect my bib number and get ready, which I was taking part in the 5K. Yes. My bib number, 38. Oh, look, I got me bib, I got me bib number 38. So close to getting number 44. We've had a couple of times uh, this year, but hey, let's go do this. Okay, just back at the van. So I now need to uh, get changed into my race gear. Yeah, let's go. Ta-da! Yes, we are now in race gear. So I'm going to put the chest strap on, attach camera to body, and take you on this wonderful 5K sprint-ish. Let's see how we do. Better do a warm-up first. One thing I forgot to mention. Yes, here's Lawrence. He's come all the way from the south coast for this race. Doing a 10K, Lawrence. I have, yes. Yeah, my third of the year, so really, really looking forward to it. Ready to go. And here we it's are. It's great at, conditions. It is per, almost perfect conditions. And I forgot to mention, guys, this is the inaugural Withal and Hollywood 5K, 10K fun run. So we're looking to do this annually. So it'd be brilliant if you couldn't make it this year to come along next year. Meanwhile, let's go and do our warm-up. As many of us know, it is absolutely essential that we do a warm-up before any run, whatever the distance may be, whether it's a fun run, 5k, 10k, always good to get that warm-up in. It goes without saying, it's essential to do the warm-up. You might have seen the jog on Harry Morgan, the one thing that you need to do without any additional training, without any anything, is a warm-up to go faster. Yes, that's right. Now, obviously, once you've been doing warm-ups before every 5k race, are you going to get any faster than the previous one? Well, then that's down to your training, <laughs> yeah? Right, let's go. Okay, I think I'm all warmed up now. Let's head over to the start and get you on the chest strap and let's take you along this wonderful route here in Withall and Hollywood. Ah, woof. Good morning, everyone! Oh, this is serious. Fancy seeing you here. Are you going to be flying together? No, I will not fly. What are we talking about today? You're going to have an easy job. So what's that, 18 minutes? I'm going to give it a go. Make sure you're not going to hit your neighbour. You can join in with whatever you want to join in with. Or not. Or do your own thing. That's up to you. We're just taking it side to side. Nice and soft on the knees. If you want, get your hands up in here. That's my excuse. That's it. Side to side. Nice. Make sure you've got that little bit of room around you. And are you ready to take it nice and low? We're going to build it up. Take it low. Really low. How low can you go? That's it. All the way to the floor down here. With your go, 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 go. Good luck everybody! Good luck everybody! With all the warm-ups completed we were now off with the start of the 5k and 10k all going off together and as you can see here starting on the grass and progressively moving on to firmer surface and yes what a great run this was!
Once we were out of the main car park area and the park, we were straight onto the closed roads for the actual course. And it, as you can see here on the course, it's pretty nice clear roads and a great way to uh, enjoy the local area. And we were all going off at quite a speed to start with. Bearing in mind, this is towards the front of the race with many hundreds of people all behind us here and going through the run. Hey, mate. Oh, this is hard work. As you heard me say there, this is now hard work because we're now coming into the last loop, literally almost at the blink of an eye, we were coming towards the finish of the 5k. And as you can see here, there are people coming back out to continue on the second loop for the 10k. Oh, that finish line feeling. There's nothing quite like it. I finished in a little over 20 minutes, which was quite epic for me. As I said earlier on the video, it was the first time I'd raced a 5K in almost four years. It was great to get that medal and finisher. Oh, come on. I'm all right, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. That was hard work. I'm happy that I finished. Happy with Could have done with a bit of time. Oh, what but did hey, you do? 20. Brilliant. Around 20. Yeah. Can't deny it, but let's get some water and recover. Get some recover. Go round again, not quite. Well, I got my goodie bag, drunk my water finished and I feel totally epic the time was nowhere near what I wanted but when do we ever get what we want we get what we train for yes remember that phrase and uh, yeah I'm just happy to have done it gave it my all went as quick as I could okay all changed and my banana recovery drink and all that jazz I feel hydrated fresh ready to go but oh boy my calves are screaming at me right now I, I, I know I'd done the best I could based on what I had today, so I've got to be happy with that, yeah? It's just great just to be out running and enjoying. Hey, hello, you're right. How are you doing? After chatting with some more familiar faces, which is always great to see, I then went over to the finish line and cheer on a lot of the finishers coming in from the 5K and 10K, and also to catch up and hear what people's views were of the race. Finishers were coming in thick and fast and it was great to see so many, so many people coming in. And also so many official pacers were beginning to come in now. The first one on the 10k being the 50 minute pacer. You told lies to me. You're 30 seconds fast. <laughs> That's pretty good. Hey Jeff! Pose for the photo. Let the ladies take a photo. Carol coming down the board of the Bonville Harris. 50 minutes. Woo! Let's go. Bang on. I kept him in front. Well There's the I man. Kept him in front. Here he go. Well done, guys. Well done. Well, well done, Bonville. High five. That's it. Border on through. Hey. Big waves, big smiles. With the Kenilworth winners. Post the photo there. Well done. Well, well done. Appearance today among the many running clubs. In the it was great to see such a diverse range of runners all out on this course. As you see here, a buggy runner finishing. What an epic run that was from that gentleman. But so many coming in of all different ages, groups, sizes, all having a good time. As mentioned, one of the best things was seeing so many happy, familiar faces. So I had to stop and speak to a number of people and ask them what they thought of this event. 
I'm Tristan Harris from the Bromsgrove Standard. I've just completed the uh, Whipple 5K fun run. First one I've done, I've run around my local area before, but I've never entered an event like this. But the course is fantastic. Everyone's so supportive. It's just so great the way they applaud you around every single step of the way. I'm so glad I've done it. Got a personal best, which was a bonus. But uh, yeah, I'll definitely start doing more events like this in the future. Excellent. Thank you, Tristan. Hi, it's uh, Adam Kent here at the Whipple and Hollywood 5K, 10K and Families on Track. And what a brilliant day it's been. I'm the local councillor for the area and myself and the public health team at Worcestershire County Council have been working really hard to try and get people of all shapes and sizes involved in exercise and to see the type of people here today has been fabulous. I think a lot of people think that running events like this or a 5k or a 10k you're going to turn up and there's a stack of athletes there that are all trying to beat world records and that type of thing but it's completely different. I mean we've just welcomed in the last finisher here you know who've, who've been helped around by the tail and it's just brilliant that these the, the volume of people that are coming look listen to the music we've got going on here yeah, it's yeah. like a party and um, it's just fabulous to get everybody out and I think getting people off the couch and into a 5 and 10k has been great they ran a couch to 5k program here that I think started with 40 people that hadn't run before yeah, yeah. I mean 40 it's just so so I'm just absolutely over the moon I think we want to try and make it bigger and better next year so anybody that's interested in a closed road event just south of Birmingham inside Worcestershire you know get down here the lanes are really country lanes absolutely brilliant no cars no traffic no nothing so get yourself down get yourself to Whithall and let's see you here next year thank you very much councillor take care the camera's rolling okay, say okay. hello how did you find it uh, fabulous uh, yeah terrific course um 500 plus entrance um back after four years and not having a fun run brilliant yeah, can't yeah, beat it yeah. best 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 run likely that's what you want anyway very much so great chat to you thank see you apart soon take care Excellent. I'm sorry about that. How do you was feel? Like, no, no, no. I was like, well, uh, how do you feel after that? I feel that good. Day? I feel good, yeah. I didn't do it. I didn't write that second, finished, but I feel finished, all right yeah. now. Excellent, uh, excellent. Yeah, well done. How about you, Emma? It's good. How do you we feel? did it. We did it in 40 minutes spot on, so yeah. Happy. Perfect timing. Yeah. And Jeff was but bang on 50 he's minutes. He's on 50 minutes, so yeah. he's happy. All good, man. All good. Two paces together. Go on. So my name's Penny, I'm from Withal, and I co-manage the Woodrush Sports Centre down in Withal. And myself and Emma, co-manager, we uh, set up the Couch to 5K course about 10 weeks ago. And we've run it with, we had about 45 people, uh, 15 of which have taken part today. And it's just, it's been really fun to build confidence. It's hard, it's hard work. It's really hard, it's really work. hard work. I'm not a runner, I had to put myself through Couch to 5K before I led the course. Yep. This is my first event. Uh, it's hard, but I'm sure tomorrow I will appreciate that I've done it. <laughs> excellent, excellent. So would you recommend this uh, event? Yes, yes definitely. Year, yes, yeah? definitely. The, the atmosphere, the community, everything is, has been fantastic. Yeah, the Brilliant. course was really good. It was a really nice course. Yeah. Everyone, it was lovely having people shouting along the way, cheering you yeah, on. Yeah. Um, and yeah, the organisation's been really great. And it's just good to kind of get into the habit of doing these runs and building excellent. the skills. Yeah. Roll on next year. Absolutely. Yeah, absolutely. Little couch to 5K, yeah? <laughs> Bring it on. Thank you. Hi, I'm Adam and I'm representing Primrose Hospice and Family Support Centre today. So we're really honoured to be the uh, the official charity partner for the Whiffle and Hollywood, uh, Hollywood um, uh, Family Fun Run today. We've had numerous runners take part in both the 10k and the 5k with us and we've had numerous other people who've donated as well. So it's been really, really great to be here. It's a fabulous event. There's loads of people around. There's coffee, there's cake. There's drinks, there's absolutely everything. Great community feel. But first and foremost for us, we're really indebted to people who fundraise for us. So everyone who's done that has helped to uh, help our work, working with people and families who have life-limited conditions from the North Worcestershire area. So every difference, everything raised today is made difference to people's lives so thank you so much a big thank you to everybody who agreed to come on camera and tell me what they thought of this amazing event i absolutely loved it even had time to do a little bit of media chat myself and squeeze in a hot dog and i very much look forward to seeing you all at next year's event where we're going to have an absolutely boston in time so many people out there enjoying it and support and i definitely recommend it and here we go with the donuts. We are running with that donut. Yes, here we go. Oh. And we quickly switch round 
switch blades. We are going really quick here. We're catching up with this little one here. We're going to overtake maybe, possibly. 